Our system, CyberKnife, we call it um, M6 CyberKnife. We are so happy that we are the first in the Middle East and what makes it unique, it is innovative, very precise. And why we call it M6? Because it has the multi-leaf collimator, which shown here. So uh, the purpose of the multi-leaf collimator, it will be shaped to be so precise, targeting the tumor volume without harming the normal surrounding organs. So usually the patient, once he diagnosed with cancer, what will happen next step, we will have a multidisciplinary group which comprise of um, radiation oncology, medical oncology, radiology, and histopathology that we are confirming that the patient having cancer for sure. And then during that meeting, we will decide if the patient need chemo and radiotherapy and what kind of a treatment that he will need. And then we will decide for a cyber knife treatment for that patient. The patient will be booked for appointment to be seen by our uh, radiation oncologist in our department for the consultation day. We will explain the technology for the patient, uh, the benefit, the side effect of that treatment. We will take him to the planning CT scan to scan the patient and to scan the lesion or the tumor. For example, if that uh, a brain tumor, we need to scan the whole brain to visualize it um, much appropriately. After we see the lesion clearly and all the surrounding normal organs, what we will do, we delineate or we will structure that lesion slide by slide until we form our target volume, we call it. So after the target volume, we will do the dose calculation distribution by our medical physicist. It will be then checked and um, approved by the physician. After doing the first treatment, then we will do the image control to make sure that we are targeting the same target volume that we draw in the first place. So usually when the patient will receive the treatment, he will be all alone in that room and we will uh, control him from outside, from the control area. As you can see, there is a camera in the, in the whole room and also the image modality, which will track the treatment time. And even if the patient moves or breathes, um, the machine will, will detect it quickly and it will correct itself. So important to have a very comfortable and friendly atmosphere for all the patients. You need to choose the color, what, what makes the patient calm and happy and uh, not very stressful, and what is the patient is looking at while he's looking up. We need to make him relax. We are so proud that we are an NCCR having a state-of-the-art department. We have all different kind of image modality and a very advanced uh, treatment unit. And CyberKnife came along to be complete with this perfection of the department. And we are so happy to have it for our patient benefit.